प्योर सब्सटांसिस एंड मिक्सचर डिफरेंस बिटवीन प्योर सब्सटांसिस एंड मिक्सचर बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द लेक्चर क्लिक ऑन द सब्सक्राइब बटन एंड गेट एक्सेस टू आर हंड्रेड ऑफ कंसेप्चुअल लेक्चर फॉर फ्री Firstly let me teach you about the classification of a matter well we all know about matter anything which has volume and has some mass is called matter for example a chair a desk a cup etc are all matter because they occupy some space and have non masses also remember that matter is divided into two groups pure substances and mixture it means that chair may be either pure substance or mixture similarly desk may be either pure substance or mixture now what is a pure substance and a mixture well a pure substance is composed of identical particles while mixture is composed of non identical particles for example consider a pure sheet of iron it is made up of one type of atoms i mean that this whole sheet of iron is made up of only one type of atoms and there is no other particle present in it hence all atoms are the same they have same sizes they have same properties and all these atoms are chemically combined together to form a pure sheet of iron therefore we say that this sheet is a pure substance now let consider a sugar solution we know that it is composed of sugar molecules c6 h12 O6 and water molecules H2O it means that this sugar solution is made up of two different types of molecules the size of sugar molecule is different than the size of water molecules so this sugar solution contains different sizes of molecules the properties of sugar molecule is different from the water molecules We also know that we have physically combined our dissolved sugar and the water to form a solution. Thus this sugar solution is not a pure substance. It is a mixture. Here we also learn that all solutions are mixture. Therefore remember that a pure substance is made up of same particles like this iron sheet. while a mixture is made up of different particles like sugar solution let me also teach you that why all elements and compounds are called pure substances well we have already learned in the previous slide that element like iron is a pure substance because all the atoms are same throughout it and they have same properties and same sizes so we therefore say that all elements are pure substances like gold copper zinc sodium etc We know that compounds are formed from chemical combination of two or more elements. We have two different types of compounds: ionic compounds and covalent compounds. Table salt or NaCl is an ionic compound. Water is a covalent compound. Now listen carefully. The smallest unit of iron sheet is an atom. The smallest unit of ionic compounds is formula unit and the smallest unit of covalent compounds is molecule and the table salt all formula units are the same are identical i mean all units are nacl all these units have same sizes same properties so all ionic compounds like salt are pure substances secondly and the water all molecules are the same are identical they have same sizes and same properties so all covalent compounds like water are pure substances now let me also give you some examples of mixture 
According to chemistry, the carbonated drinks we use are not pure substances. They are mixture because they are composed of sugar, water and different colors mixed together physically. Secondly, air is not a pure substance. It is a mixture of different gases like nitrogen gas, oxygen gas, etc. Thirdly, honey is not a pure substance. It is a mixture because it is made up of water, sugar and minerals. Fourthly, steel or coins are not pure substances. They are mixtures because steel and coins are alloy. They are made up of elements like copper, zinc, etc. Finally, let me teach you the difference between pure substances and mixture. In pure substances, particles are chemically combined together, while in mixture, particles are physically combined together. All the particles in a pure substance have same chemical and physical properties. While in mixture, different particles have different chemical and physical properties. Pure substances has uniform composition throughout its mass, while mixture has usually non-uniform composition throughout its mass. Pure substances cannot be separated into simpler substances by any physical process, while mixture can be separated by physical process like filtration. This was all about pure substances and mixture.